Hello guys, this is Adam and welcome to the Adam Lab and this time with an anime aesthetic. So I did the test for Blender previously and one of the people in the comments said, what if you would do the test but uncheck the CPU for M1 Max and you would only leave the GPU acceleration for M1 Max checked. I was like, you know what, let's do that and let's do it and then test the BMW scene and we will see how that would go. So I did that. Now before getting started let's lay the ground a little bit what we are testing with is the m1 max macbook pro 16 inch with 64 gigabyte of ram and then 30 core gpu with 10 core cpus and then 8 terabyte of nvme ssd storage and that is the maximum that you can go with the 16 inch macbook pro a plus the price for that machine is around seven thousand dollars after tax i went on and then i opened the bmw project and i started doing the testing and holy freaking cow in the previous video when i did the bmw testing we were getting around one minute and 16 seconds or one minute and 20 seconds which is not bad after clicking those settings and such what we are getting now is 50 freaking seconds at first i was like maybe that's a one-off let's do it again and i did it again and 50 seconds again and i was like okay let's do it the third time and i did it again for the third time and it was 50 frames as well and even when i did it the very last time it was actually 49 but then i was like okay let's keep it at 50. <laughs> so definitely it did shave around 30 frames just by optimizing the settings and then doing the test so that was the results when we did the test for the bmw scene with the gpu and then i was like okay we did it with the gpu let's go ahead and do it with the cpu with the optimized settings and then how see how it would go it was not very different than the very beginning it was in the realm of a three minute and a 20 seconds to three minutes and 30 seconds and that's okay because that's usually what you expected from the CPU because the CPU is a 10 core so it's the same as the M1 Pro and as the, uh, the same as every other device but when you use the GPU it's insane now as I said in my previous video I will go ahead and say it again there is still room for improvement and there is still room for optimizing Blender for the M1 and I think this is only the beginning we will definitely be seeing more stuff being optimized and getting better however seeing as such a result where it's all only 50 seconds in order to render the BMW scene I think this is definitely a step into the right direction and I would definitely recommend the M1 Max for a blender what I am curious about would be the Mac Mini Pro the Mac Studio as Apple call it we would do that test with the Ultra and then we would do that test with the M1 Max now for the M1 Max Mac Mini it should be here in two days for the Ultra it would definitely take months for it to arrive and then I will do the testing because I am really curious about that and it seems like most of you people are curious about that as well but that was the finding that i did find with the bmw scene and in my next video i will do that same test with the optimized settings for the fox scene as well and then we will see the results but aside from that thank you so much for hanging here and if you made it to the very end tell me which anime you like the most if you watch anime and if you have not watched anime tell me at least which show you would like and then you can tell me um that in the comments but aside from that this was uh, adam from the adam lab and I will see you very soon. Bye-bye.